Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel and as you can see we've got another 50 pence hunt to do. Um, the fortnight we pick up this week, um, I've got two bags. This one is all sealed bags inside and this one is rolly over bags. Now <laughs> I can see there's a there's an empty bag there <laughs> at the top that's been stuck. Um, what have we got on the stamp? Um, the 11th of... Well, it's 2022 I would say. Um, I think it's the 11th of May maybe? Possibly? But the sort code that I can easily read, 772901. Now this one, uh, the sort code, we had in the nostalgic bag some time ago. I'll put a link to that uh, video in the top right hand corner and in that one we ended up getting the 1970 old style 50 pence which uh, I think I've got in here somewhere this is album uh, number two yeah so we had the that large style 50 pence in it so what I'm going to do just like uh, South Yorkshire coins tends to do he's going to do a comparison so I'm going to start with the rolly over bags and we'll leave the seal bags for next week's video uh, or in my case I'll be doing it uh, straight after this one uh, alright so how am I going to get into this because it's like I say that the bag's stuck on the top so I'll see if I can put it open quite nicely there we go I'm trying free that bag so obviously there's going to be some loose ones inside yeah looks like they've all <laughs> managed to get to the bottom of the bag uh, right so what I'm going to do um, as I normally do is count the coins around to the side so that's one two Twenty-four, and I presume this spillage here is bag twenty-five. Right. So what I'll do is uh, do the first bag real time, and then we'll uh, speed up if we don't find anything. Uh, now, as you know, the two thousand and eight Britannias and the two thousand seventeen Shales, which are the low low minted of those type, um, I'm keeping in one of the money boxes. Oh, what a brilliant, what a <laughs> what an absolute cracker of a start! Wow, look at the condition of that, as Grozy would say. That is an absolute stunner. Don't need it for the album. Whoa. Well, well that uh I'm gonna bring uh, Gizmo back in. Actually Gizmo's been doing some uh, real help in the last uh, few hunts. They call him Gizmo as a, a shortened version of Gizmo Olympics. <laughs> um so this is the Johnson's Dictionary, 250 years. And um, that's for a mintage of 17,649,000. Uh, yeah, so Gizmo has managed to nab seven Olympics in the last three hunts, I think it is. But any of the lower minted ones, um, like I said, 2017 Shields and the 2008 Britannia to go in the money box and then of course we've got those not intended for circulation years 2009, 10, 11, 16 and 18 definite ones 2021 and 2022 still waiting to here and I still haven't found the 2020 shield which we know there's 46 and a half million of them and I do have to apologise uh, after my little rant on uh, Saturday um, I was a bit tired and uh, I was feeling the effects. So, uh, oh, rather grotty Jeremy Fisher. Oh, 
2000, oh, 2008, 2003, 2003, yeah, 3s and 8s always uh, look very similar. And that one, apart from Jeremy Fisher, is a bust. Brexit. This one's got the 31st of January 2020, and as we know now, there has been one found in the Sheffield area with the 2019 date on. <clears throat> Another Brexit there. And a third Brexit. So that's the four we've had. This is only the fourth bag. This is Tiggy Winkle from 2016. Diversity. So we've got both the 2020 versions that we've put into circulation. Public libraries. Quite high minted. I think it's just over 11 million, I think. Another grotty Britannia. It's one of the 1997. Victoria Cross Awards. Or medals, if you prefer. And this one. Uh, 2006, there is a 2019 reissue which uh, you need to be aware of. That was only put into sets of the 50 out of the 50p military set. It is, isn't it? Christopher collects Ironside. I think that one has a mintage of 7 million off the top of my head. I am still trying to learn a lot of the mintage figures. University Bill Britain. Well, as I record this, it's just been announced the new Pride 50p coin. Whether that one will go into circulation is anyone's guess. Uh, if I was a betting man, I would probably say no. <laughs> Uh, so Benjamin Bunny, first one of today, no rotation, no coin patrol stickers, I, I very much doubt if we'll ever find a coin patrol sticker, I don't know if there's that many in circulation, got another uh, Christopher Ironside, when I've seen the design on that uh, 550 I think the coloured version is, is going to be a lot more, lot, lot better than the uh, standard bunk because I tend to put all the uh, the standard base metal ones into a date run. So I might end up getting both versions. I think that's a 2008 Britannia. So we've got one for the money box. Obviously I will go through all the coins again because uh, I don't tend to flip all of them over. 
a little bit of Paddington here, somewhere in amongst this lot. Firstly, we'll kick off with another diversity. It's got a 2750p, that'll be another, oh, turn two over together. It's another Benjamin Bunny. Not in bad condition, that one. Pretty clean. Where's that Paddington gone? I saw one. Oh, he's right at the end. Paddington at the cathedral. Got another Brexit in amongst this. Again, the 2006 version. Oh dear, <laughs> got another Brexit and another diversity. for that one. Putting that the oh we've got putting that the palace which I used to find quite a lot of but uh, seems to have dried up a bit. So we're halfway to the Paddington set. Sherlock Holmes, 2019. Miniature figure of 8,602,000. Till Peter Rabbit, 19.9 million of him. It's 2017, so we'll just need Tom Kitten, which is usually the hardest one to find. But uh, 2017 set is quite time minted, so. So there are a few bags left, so you never know, he might be hiding amongst this lot. Pension money number three. Same with 50 pence on it. It's a bit gr grubby on the obverse. Oh, Mrs. Tiltmouse, very nice. Mintage of 1.7 million, so we'll take that. Another Commonwealth Games, Glasgow. Just had to move Gizmo out of the way. Seventeen. Got another Benjamin Bunny. Oh dear me! <laughs> Wasn't very clever. I think I've got them all. Oh, 
Oh, diversity. Oh, <laughs> this one is now haunting me. Uh, it took me absolutely well two and a bit years before I actually found one. And we've got one not so long back. Was it in the last hunt? Maybe. But anyway, I know it's not needed uh, for the albums, change checker album or the backfill album. So that's another one for Olympic Stan. And a shout out to Master Temple again for the public libraries. Whoa, got another one. Boxing. Um, unfortunately, I think we don't need that one either. I think I saw people acting amongst this lot. So now you've got another Benjamin Bunny. Yeah, people left right at the end. So down to the last bag. I've got a diversity to start that one off. The 2020, another diversity. And another diversity. like it is it so I will have to go through all the coins again just to check uh, any of those key dates and I will be back in a moment right I'm back and uh, had a little bit of look there's no 2017 shales now I've just realized I must have picked up the 2008 Britannia that I did find from the hunt so, uh, but I did find another three so we've now got one Two, three, should we show on the, uh, the reverse as well, and four. So one of them would have been the one that I did have on the bottom row, um, I think it was when I, I tipped the, the bag out and it just went everywhere. Anyway, so those four go in to the Bat Pig Money Box, and We've now got another two Olympics. Um, again, not, neither of these are needed for albums two and three. Album number one is the backfill. I've already got them as well. And they're also in the change checker sports section. So two more spares and they'll be going into Olympic stand. However, I'm going to keep them to one side at the moment because I'm going to uh, keep these four out and then uh, use them against uh, what we find in the sail bags. So until then, uh, well, let's have a look at this Isaac Newton again. It's an absolute, that is an absolutely stunning condition. Wow. Anyway, thanks for watching folks. And until the next hunt, um, which will be next week, but couple of minutes time for me uh, keep on hunting enjoy yourselves and i'll see you in the next one bye for now